This week, we talk about potential superhero deaths. That's right, ladies and gentlemen, you've tuned into the Chocolate Dollar Show. Hailing from the Midwest region of the United States, we introduce to you the Chocolate Dollar Podcast. That sucks when none of us sing afterwards. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we were all waiting for somebody else to do something. So anyways, as stated in the little intro bit, well, first of all, welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the Chocolate Dollar Show. I'm Jonathan. Uh, to my right, we have... Grant's on his phone. Grant's on his phone. <laughs> Across the table from me, we have... Ed. And then all the way in from Virginia himself... No. Uh, <laughs> waving wave. doesn't do anything on a podcast. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> <laughs> that's noah anyways hi there so uh stated in the intro bit uh one of the most anticipated films in fact actually i think we gave it most anticipated of 2018 in the chocolate dollar awards is warcraft right. warcraft yes so we're here to talk <laughs> about the inevitable death of the orc in yeah. warcraft um no uh, we're here to talk about avengers infinity war uh Ooh. and somebody's going to die it's Hopefully. just gonna happen yeah. It's going to be Thanos. Thanos dies. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't there like a second yeah. part to this? Suppo- it was originally yeah. going to be Infinity War Part 1, Part 2, then they changed it up. Now it's just Infinity War, and then the second one's going to have its own title, but it's basically going to be a Part 1, Part Ant-Van 2. Ant Van Man versus Spider Man. Ant Man versus Spider Man. <laughs> the second Civil War. Yeah. Anyways, um, what are you looking for, Grant? My jacket. It's right here. On okay, your. Cool. Yeah, I'll give it to you before you leave. Um, anyway, so. <laughs> Uh, the, the, this whole topic was inspired by an article that I read on Sci-Fi Wire, um, and I wanted to read just one paragraph here, really quick. It's a quote from RDJ himself uh, yeah. that kind of kickstarted the, the kind of sparked the whole idea. Uh, well, the first paragraph goes: Entertainment Weekly caught up with Robert Downey Jr. as part of the blowout Infinity War package for its latest issue, and the actor whose off-screen identity has become synonymous with Tony Stark for a generation of Marvel fans hinted that the movie was an uh, has an air of finality about it that's often lacking in superhero movies. And then his quote uh, goes: "Believe me, I'm tired of every movie. You know, it's the end. It's Armageddon. It's to be all, end all, forever. And then it's not." Uh, the ol- this one actually is. There's, uh, they're not kidding. This is a heads will roll scenario, and it goes on to talk about like how this be heads s- will roll. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> um, it goes. He, he goes on to talk about how like he'll meet with his co-stars for lunch every once in a while, and they'll just be like talking about well, who's gonna bite the dust in this one, and blah 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 blah. So I figured we'd go ahead and take a shot at predicting who oh is going to die uh, just in Infinity shot. War. <laughs> Uh, would anybody like to start with who they think it's going to be? All right, so Captain America's dead. <laughs> yeah. oh, absolutely, is... absolutely. Who uh, like? Is this who we want to die might... or who we think's going to die? Who we think is going to die? Thanos. Thanos. <laughs> no, hold on. Easier to say who won't die. Honestly. Who won't die? Really? You think? Yeah. That? I think that many people will die. Really? Yeah. Who do Who do you think won't die then? Spider Man. If they killed him no. off, though, I thought that would be cool. <laughs> right off the bat. will die, but will like, come back with some time travel on like, the second one or some nonsense. Okay. Spidey? So, have, okay, so the only uh, cartoon Thanos Infinity War thing that I've seen, essentially what happens is is they uh, they keep fighting him over and over again, and they keep dying over and over again, but Thanos keeps resetting stuff because it's not perfect. He didn't perfectly <laughs> kill them, and he's upset with that. Or whatever. Interesting. Yeah, I, I think I've, I know what you're talking about. I've seen that too. Yeah. Or something along the lines of that. Yeah. I don't really remember. But. I think I think Doctor Strange will live. I think yeah. Black Panther will live. Mm-hmm. Because um, those are the new like highlight characters right now. Yeah. I, I I'd be willing to bet that all of, with the exception of Hulk, I don't know. I just don't feel like they'd kill him off. If they do anything with him, they're gonna make they're gonna separate him. Yeah. Yep. Um, yeah. but I, I feel like you're, you're going to, I feel like Captain America for sure is going to die. At least Steve Rogers, Captain America. And he's, then, yeah. He's, he's done so. <laughs> yeah. And then I think winter soldier may step into the moniker of cap. He's, uh, he's going to, he's white wolf. Yeah. What's what, what's white wolf. Okay. So basically at the end of black Panther, Ed, have you seen black Panther? Yeah. Okay, good. 
so at the end of Black Panther, you know how like you sh- they show you Bucky and he like comes out of the hut and everything, and the kids are calling him White Wolf. Oh, okay. so so in the comics, White Wolf is a completely separate person, but he's actually some he's like the adopted brother of T'Challa, of Black Panther. Oh, so okay. Like they have like a rivalry there, but they like are like they brothers were... basically. Okay. So, but no, he won't. He won't be capped. I don't think. Um, okay, interesting. I was gonna say I don't think he's gonna be capped either, just based off of how much time. Uh, I can't think of his name, but he flies around in a wingsuit. Falcon. As, yeah, Falcon. Falcon. <laughs> Falcon punch. Yeah. yeah, how much time Falcon has spent with Captain? It's yeah. Not more, but it's more recent, kind of. Yeah. I wonder who do you guys think of the Guardians will die. I could see Drax. I, yeah. I I don't mm-hmm. think that they're going to kill off anyone else in that thing, though, because they're still hot and they've only got two movies. Yeah. I think the- if anything, they're going to kill Rocket Raccoon, but not, like, actually kill him. Just seriously injure. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he's gonna, it's going to end the movie with your questioning if he's dead or alive. Yeah. Basically. But, okay. like, the, the director said that they're going to use, like, the different, like, parts of the teams. So, like... The different teams themselves to introduce different tones within the movie itself. So, like Guardians is going to be the more lighthearted parts of the movie, and yeah. then like the rest of the Avengers and stuff, that's going to be the more somber stuff. Mm-hmm. So, that's what makes me think like they'll only kill like one Guardian. Yeah, that, if even the if rest even. of yeah, and then the rest of the Avengers will be fine. Mm. You know who they're gonna? So they just got off of killing a Guardian of the Galaxy, essentially. Uh, oh yeah, with uh, um, Yondu. Mm-hmm. So I That's think true. I think if anybody's gonna die, it's what? gonna be a uh, <laughs> it's gonna be a sacrifice. Uh, no sister, kind of. Yeah. One of the two yeah. sisters. Right. One, one of them is gonna be like. I could see maybe Nebula. Yeah, Nebula biting the dust. First one to go. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So. It, it, since since we are talking about this, spoilers for literally any and all Marvel movies. Oh yeah, or, or this that's to be assumed. Yeah, yeah. Let's, Gosh, okay, was... let's just go around. And yeah, like, let's say who we think is gonna die. Okay. So Grant, yeah, you, Grant, you go ahead and start. Okay, so uh, <laughs> Captain America, or the ways known as Nomad, right now. Yep. If he's not gonna die in this one, he's gonna die in the second one. But I feel like he he's gonna. This I don't is know. the beginning of the end. I for feel Cap. like I feel like everybody's expecting him to die, so they might not kill him. Yeah. yeah. Um, I I also have reasons to assume they're going to kill him off because I know that it, well his contract is expiring soon, and as much as he loves the character, I know he's also expressed interest in getting into directing and stuff like yeah. that. And so and having like, bad mustaches. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> so continuing to like play Captain America might make it difficult for him to do that. I could see him being less of a prominent character in the MCU if they don't kill him off, but at the same He's, time... He said the fourth one he's done, like, that's his last movie, yeah. for sure. So they'll probably kill him in this one, and then the fourth one will have, like, flashbacks or time travel or something, but then mm-hmm. he'll still be dead afterwards, so I don't know. Yeah. I think I think he doesn't die in this one, or the entire team, like, everybody dies at the end of this one. You never know. Yeah. yeah. Um. But, like, I, I think he doesn't die in this one, and then he dies in the next one, and then, like, some, then, like, for some reason, they're like, yeah, let's not use the Infinity Gauntlet to bring him back. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You know what I mean? They're just, like... Yeah. I, I'd almost feel like if that's a thing, that's going to be a thought that they introduce in the beginning of the movie that uh, Captain America pioneers, I think. Like... Maybe maybe they'll kill off Spider Man pretty early on, and somehow they're able to use the gauntlet in some sort of way to bring him back. And then Tony Stark's like, "This is the answer to avoiding my nightmare from uh, Age of Ultron." And then Cap is all like, "No, that's not right. We shouldn't do that. We should, you know." Well, they'll, I, they'll still have the time stone, so they can use that, you know, to begin with. Mm-hmm. Which, by the way, which one's the time stone? The one that that's the one in Doctor Strange, the green one. Yeah, yeah, he has uh... the yeah. So let's let's think. Okay, really quick recap. What stones does Thanos have at this point, and then which Tess, ones? He has the Tesseract. He has the Tesseract. Which is the does space. He? Or does mean... he'll start off with getting the Tesseract because at the end of Ragnarok, Loki yeah. had it, and then like you see Thanos' ship, like yeah, we capture them. Gotcha. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. Um, he and does. He, has the he doesn't have the power time. Stone yeah, he has the power Guardian. stone. 
he has that. How did he get that? He picked that up from destroying. Uh, well, the, duck. on Zan. The last time we saw it, it was. Star. Do you think what's his name? Uh, that the gold people in Guardians of the Galaxy two, they're gonna. Adam Warlock. No, no Adam Warlock. They're not gonna show. Yeah. Was that just a? Was that Miss Marvel's not uh, is in was Correct. initially going to, but she's either. not in this either. So um, she was on set for the movies, so they definitely did photography with her, but they they probably cut it from the movie. Mm-hmm. I don't know. Yeah, but um, so Captain, I I think Captain's gonna die. Grant thinks Captain's gonna die. Ed, what do you think? Yeah, I'm pretty. I feel like he's gonna die too. I think he he has honestly. I think the only other person that can die is uh, Tony. Yeah. 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 Well, because does Chris Hemsworth have an extension or, or anything at all? I think he wants to extend his contract. I don't know if they will happen. I, don't, I we'll think see. he's the most solid character they have. Yeah. But after they kill Cap and, and, and Iron Man, yeah. Yeah. I don't know. I, I kind of have like a feeling that... Uh, Iron Man is Iron Man may hit the dust in the sense of Tony Stark's just like no more I'm done I'm retiring but I don't I just feel like they're going to send him off rather than kill him off. Does that make sense? I don't yeah. know. I just have a, a gut feeling about that. I I, do. There, I have nothing to back that up. It's just I, it's just like that's what it seems like they would do with him. I would kind of agree with that because the very, very he's very grandfather character mm-hmm. to all of this. Yeah. So they're they're not going to give him a if they're gonna kill him, it's not gonna be meaningless, and it's not gonna be cheesy. It's gonna be really, really yeah, good. It's gonna be yeah. really hard. Well, because that was the first movie. That was their starting point. Was or Iron Man. yeah, I think he's gonna. They're gonna come up with some BS, and it's gonna be like he burnt himself out with like the Animus or not the Animus, <laughs> Artemis, the 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 nano suit. Oh, the bleeding edge. Yeah, bleeding edge. Whatever. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. Like the bleeding edge. Yeah. Like they're gonna come up with some reason like he can't wear the suits anymore. Yeah. Or or he's just like uh, stubborn and is like I'm done. I'm not doing it anymore. And everybody's but that's just completely like completely against yeah. his character. Right. Yeah. yeah but he's, and but he's already said that in Iron Man three. He was like I'm done being Iron Man. And then he was like just kidding. I'm back as Iron Man. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um. Honestly, I feel like Cap and is the only one that's going to... I feel like that Vision may get killed off, but then when they defeat Thanos... Because I think his power source is basically that Infinity Stone, and they're going to either going to get the Infinity Stone at one point or another. I mean, yeah, they're going to rip it out of his head, but does that mean he's dead? Sometimes yes, sometimes no. Yep. We don't really know which direction they're going to take. He could just be like uh, Or it'll just be Silver Vision Surfer. without the personality. Yeah. Well, the personality isn't the stone. Well, yeah, but... It's it's also Marvel Universe and they don't make perfect scientific scientific, scientific sense yeah. anyway. So no, like the personality isn't the stone though. <laughs> he doesn't. Yeah, sure. he his life force is connected Jar- to oh, yeah. yeah, it's which, Jarvis and the stone combined. Yeah, so. yeah. Which there's a thing he might be able to survive without it. I'm just thinking of uh, like Silver Surfer minus Surfboard. You know, not that yeah, that's a good well, movie, but like you know where he's like completely yeah. depowered down. You know? Here, here's the thing with uh, Vision. I think he will die, but will come back different because he's an android and he can basically just be rebuilt. Yeah, yeah. So he'll die. That's a good call. But then, like, come back. But he's gonna I have mean? to have Papa Thor hit him with a lightning bolt. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Papa Thor. Um, I think Thor is essentially his father. Yeah. Yeah, he has like yeah, it's, it's him. It's. It's him? what happens when Robert Downey Jr. It's, and Chris Hemsworth come together. It's, it's, <laughs> it's Robert. Down, it's Robert Downey Jr. Chris Hemsworth. Yeah. And Ultron. Yeah. Not Chris Hemsworth. You know what I mean? The Thor. Thor. Yeah. yeah. So those three. You know, he has those three are his are his uh yeah, his papas. His, his papas. His yeah. papas. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean and yeah. and and the girl who made the entire Genesis. Oh yeah, that one thing. South Korean girl. Yeah, Doctor yeah. Chick, yeah. I'm gonna be completely honest, I forgot who that was until you guys mentioned it. And I was like, Oh yeah. Yeah. She was a thing. Thanks. So I feel like Vision's gonna die, but then he's gonna come back. And then yep. when they finally defeat Thanos in the second movie, they're going to put the stone back in Vision, and it's going to be hunky-dory. Um, Real quick, what? who are all the um, superheroes in the Avengers movie? Obviously, um, we have the Avengers, 
Guardians of the Galaxy, but then we also have Black Widow. Yeah, Hawkeye, Black Widow, Black Panther, Hawkeye, Falcon, uh, Falcon, Ant Man, Ant Man, Spider Man. Wasp- will- I don't, I don't know if Wasp is gonna be. She's not gonna be in the first one. She'll be in the second one. Okay, that's right. Yeah. So because Ant Man and the Wasp comes between the two, right? Correct. Yeah, it comes okay. out July of this summer, or that's June, right. July or June, I think. Live. Yeah, Ant-Man it comes out live. live. Yeah, it comes out like Broadway. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that is an odd take It's a on musical. It. They're really going into it. <laughs> um, so yeah, you've got the four original. Oh, Doctor Avengers. Strange. Yeah, Doctor Strange, um, and then like a bunch of the sub characters like War Loki. Machine. You have War Machine, Loki, um, Black like... Panther, and all of his people. Yeah, so... is Martin Freeman coming back with his as his character? I don't know. Morgan His sister Freeman? Shuri is going to be Martin Freeman. It. Or Martin Freeman. I was like... Okay. Yeah, sure. And then... Um, Samuel L. Jackson? He's actually not. They confirmed that he's not uh, in Nick it, yeah. Fury will not be in it. Ooh. What do you guys think about Hawkeye? Do you think Hawkeye's going to buy it? Uh, no. Uh, really? And they gave the him reason, a family. Yeah, the reason why is because they have kept his entire, like, story. He's not in any of the advertising, right? Yeah. He- been in any of the trailers he's been in like the very first poster that they put out but like barely yeah and the, the same as ant-man so those two characters i think are fine scarlet witch is fine i think dr strange will be okay uh everyone else i think is honestly gonna die all of them yes I now think, are you saying I die think... with the intention that they're gonna come back with the time stone or something or I don't... do you think they're gone for good i don't Even i don't can't really say that because they they haven't really talked about their phase four plans like what they're going to do afterward yeah. so it might be that they permanently are dead and gone i think Cause... they could wipe the entire avengers out and then they have the new avengers which is going to be spider-man black doctor panther. strange doctor black, black, black panther, panther yeah uh yeah. miss wolverine Ms. marvel or whatever <laughs> yeah miss marvel yeah. um do you uh, yeah w- uh, do you think black widow yeah, no, she's, she's so dead. <laughs> okay. Gosh. I mean, I, I could see her death being what kind of triggers Hulk. Uh, I don't know if they'll kill Hulk. They might kill one half of Hulk. Banner? They might kill Banner or they might kill Hulk, Hulk and then yeah. leave the other. Gotcha. That'd be, I don't know. I don't know how they, they would. Huh. I think what they're going to do is if they're going to kill Hulk, they're going to separate them apart. Mm-hmm. And then uh, kill Hulk, and then they're gonna have they're they're because you're thing, there's so many characters they can't dive into their psyches that much. Yeah. So it's right. either he's brought in back or they come up. I think because like there's there's been comics where it's like they separate and then one of them mm-hmm. dies. Mm-hmm. They separate and then one of them dies and then they realize <laughs> that like they're actually the same person. Yeah. Like, mm-hmm. And then they and then like the person then they're not dead kind of thing <laughs> you know what i mean yeah. then like then like right. the, the like, hulk then turns back into banner and they're like oh <laughs> <laughs> yeah i just cloned myself what <laughs> no exactly i mean like that's pretty much what it is is like yeah. yeah yeah okay so you really think wow that's that's gonna be i don't know that they'd kill all of them off like i think mm-hmm. that the, I, like i think they they honestly have to like why, these why are real, these are real life actors. Like this isn't yeah. a comic anymore, so they can't really bring these people back. Because actors like they get bored. They want to go yeah. do other things. Yeah. They get old. You know, yeah. Robert Downey Jr. is almost sixty at this point. Yeah. <laughs> so like these people like need to like oh. be released and gone. They're gonna they're gonna pull uh, Professor X on him and put him in a wheelchair and keep him forever. <laughs> I was, I was yeah. thinking that too, actually, but I was like, ah, I don't know. But actually, no, because like Rhodey's technically like, ooh, he's fine. He, yeah, he, he's he's yeah. fine now, but like, yeah. he wasn't there for a bit. So sorry, when you say like all of them, you you think like just the original four or the original uh, six? No, I'm saying all of the. Uh, I'm okay. Thor dead. Hulk, half dead. <laughs> uh, Black Widow, dead. Double Hawkeye, dead. alive. Captain America, dead. Iron Man, dead. Vision, dead, but will be brought back because he's an android. Scarlet Witch, alive. Um, Spider Man? Spider Man, probably going to die, uh, but will be brought back with Time Stone, probably. Pepper Potts uh, is dead. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Pepper Potts is dead. Uh, uh, 
Doctor Happy. Strange, maybe alive. Uh, his sidekick Wong, dead. Uh, Black Panther, alive. Shuri, alive. Uh, all the Black Panther people are fine. They're yeah. making a Panther. That's yeah, they're fine. <laughs> they, made, <laughs> they made enough money to literally. Yeah. You guys get yeah. to live. <laughs> <laughs> um, it? It's like okay. Don't take this the wrong way, but Stop. if your movie sucks. <laughs> yeah. Gosh. We're killing all of you. <laughs> um, okay. I Yeah, I, I pretty much agree with that assessment there. I don't know. I feel like... Do you think I, other Wakandans are going to die, like his sister or something? I think well, they're, okay. they're going to have Let's, the city be destroyed. Yeah. And, maybe, and then, like, scattered. But I right. don't think they're going to be, like, Wakanda is now not a thing. Yeah. <laughs> Because like from the from the trailers, they're showing us to like basically the third act is going to take place where they're fighting for Wakanda, right? Yeah, well, like that's what yeah, giant, that's the whole setting. Yeah, that's that giant. That's the shot where uh, all of the good guys are charging. Oh, well, really? They're they're fighting to protect the last stone. Probably, we don't really know for sure. It might be that they're fighting to keep Vision alive because we don't know where the Soul Stone is. I don't think it's at Wakanda. I think they would have shown us if it was in Wakanda. I think it's Vision that like Shuri will, like brought him back to life. This is his new body, like because it's made from vibranium, right? Mm. So like I think that they're still trying to protect Vision, and they're trying to get the stone from Vision. Um, but I don't know. We'll see. I think that. Uh... Wait, do we know where all the stones are at this point? Uh, other than the Soul Stone, yes, we do. Soul Stone, Heart of Wakanda. That's I don't the... think so. I really don't. <laughs> I mean, it's possible. It's very possible it was like in that giant vibranium like yeah. here, right? but like I don't think so. I think it could be. I, uh, it could I don't be. Know. I don't know that it will. Like I feel like that'd be too easy of a place to put it. I know? mean, yeah. but well, then what's his name should show up with it. But that puts three Infinity Stones on Earth. That doesn't make much sense to me. I mean, Earth. Oh, Earth has been. It like... is fiction. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Ed. <laughs> Wait, where? Like, are, okay, so the Tesseract is like we assume that Thanos Loki has, has it. it. Loki and, and has it. Well, yeah. yeah. But like, where are the other ones again? Because we okay, Vision has the one in his head, and then Doctor Strange has the Time Stone. Doctor Strange has a, another one. <clears throat> so then we're missing so, two more. There's the Soul Stone, and then there's the Power Stone. The, the red Power one. Stone. The red one is the reality stone. That was with the, the collector last the, we saw it. The floaty, so, yeah. floaty liquid. Purple one from Guardians of the Galaxy. That's a power stone. Is that was mm-hmm. that with the collector? Is that on? Uh, no, no, that's on that. I um, was on Xandar. Xandar, that's and, right. And that at the beginning of this movie. So, whoops, <laughs> <Yep>. <laughs> whoops. <laughs> so much Xandar. Gotcha. Xandar, okay. not exactly the vacation location it used to be. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah. that might be how Nova is made, you know? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. so. Okay, so I can see that being a post credit scene in this here's one. Here's the thing. Is... I, I miss the old Nova stuff. I'm not sure if they're going to do it, but the old Nova stuff was that there was tons of Nova Corps, and it all had to do with the helmets that they were wearing. And the power was shared throughout all of this network of Nova Corps members. Anyway. Mm-hmm. When they all died, all the power went to one person. Yeah. So now this one person's super powerful. Because that's yeah, he is the the last survivor of the Nova. Nova. Corps. So yeah. that that's his the original Nova. That's his backstory. So he's the last survivor. So yeah. So like, that would a, make sense. But I but they didn't really do that like whole helmet thing of the Nova Corps. They like kind of, but yeah, not really. They like they really could have sold it. Yeah, in some it's way, still something they can build off of, maybe in right. this movie yeah. that they could be like, oh, by the way, you remember those helmets? No, that'd be dumb. <laughs> that'd be dumb but oh, sure, okay. <laughs> I mean, they, could. I mean, they, they could. definitely could. I mean, okay. it, it, is is Nova like actually been confirmed that like they're gonna work towards that, or is it just kind of people are speculating and saying we want a Nova movie? Oh, and, it's speculation and, at this yeah. point. I was gonna say, I, I don't feel like they, which kind of sucks because like they have a lot of potential to be. Although, wait, okay, so sorry. I'm uninformed about Miss Marvel and her whole thing. What is um what's Depends her on backstory? The one. Depends on the Miss Marvel. Yeah, it does because <laughs> Captain Marvel, who is what we're getting. Yeah. Oh, that's okay. nice. to, she's tied to like the Kree scroll war. So she's like her her DNA is basically Kree. fused with Kree DNA and mm-hmm. like like one of the Kree super soldiers like powers basically. 
we don't know because they said that they're going to rewrite her origin story for the movie so we don't really know like what it'll actually look like because she um, it's literally captain marvel like captain is the is the designation of the person and yeah. it has to it has to do with the color yeah. that they're wearing originally yeah. she was wearing like i don't know like white or something like that and, and that free that Cree soldier like his name was marvel yeah <laughs> Oh, okay. <laughs> so like that's exactly that's I exactly wonder, what it was, and the Kree soldier was like, "Have my power, yeah, go do yeah. stuff." <laughs> I wonder, they, I wonder if maybe like they're gonna kill off. Well, I mean, like we said, Captain is gonna die regardless. Um, but I wonder if they're gonna set it up to where she's kind of hinted at and introduced as the replacement. She's not a replacement though. She's not, but I mean, like, if they're rewriting her origin story, she's I almost... not on Earth. Yeah, she's no, not. No, I mean, I mean, to like to 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 fill that role on the team, like the 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 leader. They, the... they well, like I understand what you're saying, Jonathan. Yeah, uh, they have said that like they are people with very similar, um, like outlooks on life and yeah. like traits their... and perspectives. Yeah, they're, 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 like do gooders of the team. Like they're always going to stand up for like what's right. <laughs> Like that type of thing. Yeah. What'd you say, Ed? <laughs> yeah, he, he thought you said hair. What oh, did you... no. <laughs> it's like, oh, good. Good. They good. have similar I was... hair. <laughs> yeah. They have similar styles of hair. They're both blonde. <laughs> yes. <laughs> That's how they fill in the team role. Frosted tips. We need, <laughs> we need, we need the blonde with the, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the blonde Frosted with the, tips. with the red, we white, and blue. Peppers to be Heck like yeah. <laughs> Actually, speaking of Nova, well, like we've talked about characters that will die. Are there any characters that in like comic books that you we haven't seen yet or heard whether or not they're going to be in this that you think, oh, well, in the comic books, there was blah, 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 who showed Nova. up. Nova is yeah. the only one. There's no like. Uh, Orlock is like in the universe, but he's not going to show up in this movie. Yeah. yeah. Um... <laughs> Which I'm super excited for Adam Warlock, to be honest. But they've pretty much captured or. Like included all of the main ones that were in the comics. Yeah, with the story yeah. that could be in. Okay, except for I Fantastic mean, Four. Yeah, exactly. The Fantastic yeah. Four, but they don't really have the Fantastic Four completely yet. So yeah, which which brings me to this though, because I know that Disney acquired Fox, and we had that conversation. I don't know if it was in a podcast episode or not, but um, about how is the the potential of the X Men story to kind of be introduced to the mcu in some fashion or another um do you think that like that would be kind of the direction they may go from here as far as like so once we kill off all these guys we have this whole new potential to bring in the x-men and the mcu and kind of build on that a little bit no because like the whole entire thing with the x-men is like it's been going on since like the world war ii you know yeah yeah I guess. also but okay it, yeah so like with the marvel or sorry the disney fox deal <clears throat> yes disney acquired fox but they haven't like the acquisition hasn't actually gone through yet true so they don't own fox right now yeah so we're waiting to see if that actually goes through uh, yeah. so I don't think so. like Marvel at this point they're like we have enough to, to work with we don't really need the X-Men or the Fantastic Four I would love to see a Marvel Fantastic Four I couldn't care less about the X-Men the X-Men can do whatever they want um, but the yeah. Fantastic Four would be really good to see yeah I see him return similar to how seeing Spider-Man return to Marvel was a right really right. nice <laughs> exactly it was essentially Sony's being like please don't buy us <laughs> <laughs> Sony's like, yeah, we don't know what we're doing. Here you go. <laughs> yeah. All right. I cool. think that they can't kill Spider-Man off for that reason, actually. Because yeah, so- for, for yeah, because Sony. But that's why I'm saying he'll die and then be brought back. Yeah. The, well, and then he's only just been reintroduced into the MCU, so I don't. Like, I feel like anybody who only has a movie or two movies is going to be safe. Oh, you know what point. I hope they do? What? I mean, I've seen this. I've seen that. I remember that, like, uh, Thanos will use the time stone jokingly and, like, turn somebody into, like, a baby. <laughs> that oh. would be really funny. Like, turn back their life, just then that's it. Yeah, so, like, you're carrying around, like, baby Thor. <laughs> 
What if they did with like Captain America? Yeah. So it's just like, oh, well, great. Here we go again. <laughs> yeah, look at this scrawny kid. <laughs> but, okay. And that, the, and that's, if yeah. they do that, they could make a really, really heartfelt and good message, like callback to the first movie where he's like getting beat up in the alley and says, like, I could do this all day. Oh, like, yeah. That happens. That yeah. Would be insane. That, I feel like if that's against it. Thor, though, he's not going to have time to say lines. He's just going to die. <laughs> <I can't laughs> be like, I could. <laughs> no, no, that'd actually be really great. Turn him back and, like, like could some, you do li- this some line about, like, you know, you're just a pretend soldier. You, do you know who you really are kind of yeah. thing? And then he, like, reverses him. And, and then it's just like, it's a, like, I can do this all day. Like, it's and... still the same. You know, he's still the same. Like, yeah. Well, it just goes to show that, like, Captain is Steven Rogers, not necessarily the serum that he was. He was just blessed right. with his super abilities because he got fortunate and because he was chosen to take on those powers because of who he was so true i was kind of hoping fury would actually die in the last movies uh winter soldier yeah the reason being is because then uh eventually uh captain's serum runs out because his serum wasn't supposed to be like a forever thing it was supposed to be like a we're off of yeah it was supposed to be like a you know we dose you every once in a while kind of thing mm. Wait, um, I don't think they said that in the movie, though. No, no. but, like, in the comics, that's what it's yeah. supposed to be. Yeah. Um, But, like, anyway, so, that, yeah, maybe I know it's said in the movie. But, like, eventually, in the comics, his serum wears off, and he's just kind of like a normal old guy. And he takes over Fury's position, essentially. Yeah. Ooh. He becomes the director of S.H.I.E.L.D. Yeah. Well, not really S.H.I.E.L.D. It's kind of... Although, like, they couldn't really do that Hydra. now, because, like, <laughs> I, I have, I've i lost track of uh, Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D., the TV series, but I think, like, isn't Coulson technically the new director of shield or whatever yeah how, how has this on the air quotes. how like, has tony not figured that out <laughs> yeah, true also yeah. i don't think the tv shows are ever gonna align with the movies I no think no they are 100 like, yeah whatever that's another universe we can do with that later <laughs> yeah <laughs> okay if when we get a big enough budget then we'll get it yeah what do we think about loki yeah oh, that's a good dead. point. he's dead as crap the thing is, is like, the gonna... gods don't really die, die. I feel like they can't kill both. Or if both they... Loki and Thor? Yeah. So here's the thing. Thor right now Let's say should have... have the Odin Force because he's now the king of Asgard. Right, right. And that, that, the Odin Force, which is now called the Thor Force because it's just whoever owns it. <laughs> um, <laughs> the Asgardian Force abilities. Uh, no, no. It's, it's, just, it's, just, it's just amplified powers, yeah. essentially. Yeah. Uh, why don't they just hand that out to everybody? And it's like, <laughs> oh, by, the, by the way, we're OP now. <laughs> well, it's like, that's, 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 that's supposed to be like what ancient Asgard was. Yeah. That's right, ancient, yeah. As, ancient Asgard is supposed to be like, everybody had this power. We ruled, we, we kind of ruled the galaxy. <laughs> yeah. But if everybody's super. No, no, nobody's. Nobody super. <laughs> Dude, yeah, do we... a trailer for that. Did you guys see the new trailer for that? For what? Uh, I have not two. actually. Yeah. Incredibles two looks awesome. Yesterday. The new trailer came out yesterday. I haven't seen the new trailer. I saw the first one they put out. I think I think I watched it. It's it's a much better trailer than the first one. The first one was kind of a letdown, honestly. Defines who I am. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, okay, so I all think, four original Avengers are gonna be dead. I think Thor doesn't die. I I I would agree with that. I maybe. Just because I, I know think... that Chris Hemsworth like enjoys that character, and yeah. I but can that, see him. That doesn't mean that they're not gonna kill him. <laughs> no, that's true. It's true. But I, I also feel like he's, he's just recently taken a new turn of like tone in his movies, and there's like this whole new aspect to Asgard right now. Yeah. I feel like killing Thor off right at the beginning of that is kind of you're giving up an opportunity to actually create a really interesting story. Money. Oh, and yeah. money. Just story. <laughs> a story. Yeah, I think story, they should right. do. Yeah. I think um, they should do Thorverse and the uh, uh, the the unworthy son, or whatever yeah. it's called, where Thor becomes unworthy and what's her name picks up the hammer and she has Natalie cancer. Natalie Portman. Jane. Yeah, that's that is a good storyline. Um, so it is it is interesting to think about that because like at the end of Ragnarok, they j- basically destroyed like Asgard completely. Yeah. And like all the Asgardians are on that ship, right? Yeah. They become a like, fleet society. Where do we go now? Yeah. And so right after that movie, into this movie, Thanos is gonna pick them up, take the stone and like 
kill everyone. Like that's kind of like yeah, de- just yeah. destroys all of Ragnarok. Like Ragnarok, they just saved everyone from destruction of Asgard. They just prolonged so, Ragnarok. I yeah. see yeah, it. Exactly. I see it as what's gonna happen is it's gonna be like Thanos is gonna show up and Loki's either gonna do one or two things sell out which honestly wouldn't be the worst thing that would happen yeah honestly if loki sold out and was like i got you the so the stone my boy and was like <laughs> you know gave him the stone he and, and then it was just like okay i'll you know i'll spare the asgardians except for you with the eye patch yeah. <laughs> you know what yeah. i mean like yeah like i th- i think that's i think that's what happens i well, that, that that would be Hulk interesting is on that thing. Ship too Hulk yeah is on that too so, yeah, that's right. That's right. He is on there. So that, that could be, be where there's. I don't know. I don't know. Somehow he gets back to Earth. Yeah. That could be a cool opening cut scene. Yeah. Well, something's gonna happen though Probably to them will. because you know that the way that Guardians gets brought in is because they find Thor. Right. Like, that's in the first trailer. That's right. how it starts. How well, they're like, gonna pick have him you seen up the off the, the How is he not dead? <laughs> I don't know. Have you seen that one recently? No, I haven't. The they they the guardians pick him up and they're like he's like how is he not dead and and uh, Drax is all like because he's a man a muscular man <laughs> <laughs> that's actually really funny gosh um wait real quick can we make scorecards and uh, um like your plot and so then we can like cross off who we think's gonna live or die oh that oh, would be fun bingo. actually. That Bingo. would be fun. <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh. Okay, so we'll make we'll make. Uh, we'll see, so we make... can't be playing it during the game. You just like you know you play it before because otherwise we're gonna annoy everyone. And this isn't Warcraft. We yeah. Just... <laughs> <laughs> well, what we what we could do is we could um I could open up a word document. We can put like people's predictions, and then like when the movie actually comes out, we'll see who is the most correct. Yeah. Publish it. We can go Publish around it that. somewhere. Yeah. On, like, Twitter. Yeah, yeah, yeah we'll put it on uh, Twitter or MySpace or something. So okay, no, I'm opening up a Word MySpace. document. We'll we'll start with Noah and we'll work our way around over. Wait, to... can we do? Can we like have? I really haven't done research. I'd like to look at it more. I mean, I mean, I'm definitely they learning have to a do lot research. here. It's just predictions, honestly. Yeah. It's like March. Think of it like March Madness, Ed. Yeah. <laughs> yeah okay. Well, well actually, like, actually, well, because like, which hero dies? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um. Here, here's what. Here's all the information you really need to know. Who's okay. The people whose contracts are expired, Robert Downey Jr., um, Chris Evans, is Chris Hemsworth, his is expired. I feel like there's a couple of heroes that they haven't really released the contract details of, so we don't really know. Yeah. But like, yeah, Captain America is like the number one suspect getting the, get the boot. Okay, tell you what, let's, uh, let's go ahead and come with predictions now, then you can do more research and then we can yeah, alternate no, it. And then. Fine. We'll, we might do like a, a bonus episode after Infinity War comes out and we'll talk about and kind of do a final tally or yeah. whatever. Okay, so let's go ahead and start with you, Noah. Um, who do you think is going to die? And then bonus points for how they how you think they're going to die. Oh, well, gosh. Um, yeah, I feel like this is way more complex. I was just thinking of like who's you, you have a list of all the characters and be like dead or alive and yeah, then just yes. go through. <laughs> Okay, the, fine. The dead are alive. Okay, so let's go. Dead. Captain America. Dead. Dead. Okay. Hold on. In between. Okay. Uh, who's, but who's then next? he killed. <laughs> I'll Iron go. Man. I'm putting Noah dead. first. <laughs> Iron Man heavily maimed. Okay, hold on. I gotta put Grant's down now too, because <laughs> heavily maimed. Captain America. What if Cap is actually Hydra yeah. and they don't kill him? They he's just not Captain America anymore. He's like you said, heavily maimed. Heavily maimed. Okay. Um, Ed, who, what did you think about Iron Man? Like, what'd you say? What's your prediction? I mean, I guess if you said their contracts are expired, they. That that being said, Robert Downey Jr. has been expired for a while. He's been negotiating contracts on a case by case basis. Oh wow! So. It's, it's, which yeah, is which is okay. And, and you, you all think things Captain's considered, die, like right? is that what you said? He he could push for more money, just, but he like cut one of his contracts down. Yeah, for like yeah. he loves that role. He he's oh, born yeah. to play that role, and he loves it. He so, loves the role, and he loves Marvel because Marvel will pay him a crap load of money. Yeah, exactly. So yeah. like, I I I'm almost hard pressed. To, like I think yeah. Anyway, I'll, I'll get to that in a second. And remind me, you said Captain America. What did you think? Is gonna die. I thought we were gonna do this on our own time. 
Just like oh, on our own time. I, I mean, well, we, I was just we could do it, it right now. here. Yeah, we could just just make a make a list that says all their okay. characters' names, dead I'll or alive. We can that. all I'll fill send it out. You guys, we'll fill it out and what we think. Um, we don't know what then, we're doing. We're just winging yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, okay, cool. So it's getting about time to wrap up. I think think that's some good information to go off of. We'll do we'll do a bonus episode when Infinity War comes out after we've all seen it, and we can do a tally. I'll send a Google form to you guys. You can put who you think is gonna die and whatnot. Blah 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 blah. Do we know what the title <laughs> of this next one is called? The what? They have Infinity War, and then you said there's. I don't know that they've announced what the next one's gonna be yet. Infinity, Even longer. War. Infinity War. <laughs> we have to. Okay, let's let's have you like. A, everything we have to have this like our predictions done. Uh, yeah. By Friday. The week before um, by next friday okay yeah so the 20th correct yeah okay okay so we'll, we'll we'll fill those out we'll put it together um and then when infinity war comes out we'll all go see it i'm gonna get tickets for you guys so we can go see it opening oh, night no <laughs> when does it come out gosh when does two it weeks. come out seven two weeks yeah wait what what day is that 27th? uh i think it, yeah i think it's a 27th that comes out right <laughs> so opening uh the uh midnight showing would be the 26th oh dang it <sighs> do we have finals is that during that week i have one on one of the days we'll play it by ear somehow we're gonna go see it he transferred? the four of us or the yeah. three of us you're you're i know you're gonna see it uh noah so and then, then we'll, we'll we'll do a, a recap and uh yeah we'll do that all right Thank you guys for listening to this episode of the Chocolate Ooh. Dollar Show. If you liked it, please feel free to subscribe on either iTunes or YouTube. You can like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter. Uh, Try to do more research next time. Talk yeah. to you later. <laughs> yeah, t- hey. Till next time, Chocolate Dollar. Sign Bye. Off. Bye. Thank you for listening to the Chocolate Dollar Podcast. Check in next time.